Hi students, welcome to my channel, Excellent Ideas in Education. Today we are going to solve this pair of linear equation problem. Vijay invested a certain amount of money in two schemes A and B, which offer interest at the rate of 8% per annum and 9% per annum respectively. He received Rs. 1860 as the total annual interest. However, had he interchanged the amount of investment in the two schemes, he would have received 20 more as annual interest. How much money did he invest in each scheme? So, what is given in this question? Let the amount of money in scheme A be, we will take it as rupees X. Let the amount of money in scheme B be rupees Y. You see certain amount of money in two schemes A and B. That one we can take it as rupees X, rupees Y. Which offer interest at the rate of 8% per annum and 9% per annum. So next uh, interest at the rate of 8% per annum on scheme A plus interest at the rate of 9% per annum on scheme B. So what is given? He received Rs. 1860 as the total annual interest. So we will write it as 1860. Next. So interest at the rate of 8% per annum on scheme A is per annum means simple interest formula. What is simple interest formula? Principal into rate into time divided by 100. Principal is X. Rate is 8 into per annum. The time period is 1 year divided by 100. Plus Y into 9 into 1 divided by 100 is equal to 1860. Next 8X by 100 plus 9y by 100 equal to 1860. This 100 goes this side. 8x plus 9y is equal to 186000. This is the first equation. Next, however, had he interchanged the amount of investment in the two schemes? So, now we will interchange 9% to scheme A, 8% to scheme B. Next, Interest at the rate of 9% per annum on scheme D plus interest at the rate of 8% per annum on scheme B. So, what is given? He would have received 20 more as annual interest. So, already is given 1860. 20 is more. Next, x into 9 into 1 divided by 100 plus y into 8 into 1 divided by 100 is equal to 1880. Next, 9x by 100 plus 8y by 100 equal to 1880. 9x plus 8y is equal to 1880 This is the second equation. Add first and second equation. First equation is 8x plus 9y is equal to 186000. 9x plus 8y is equal to 18830. Add this one. So 17x plus 17y is equal to 0, 0, 0. 8 plus 6 is 14. Balance 1. 16, 17, 7. Balance 1, 3. So 17x plus 17y is equal to 374. 17 take it outside x plus y is equal to 374 30. 
So x plus y is equal to 37430 divided by 17. So 117s are 70, 217 are 34, 3, 2. So 2, 2. So x plus y is 22,000. This is third equation. Next, subtract equation 1 and 2. We can take the biggest number first. 9x plus 8y is equal to 18830. 8x plus 9y is equal to 18630. Minus x minus is the biggest number so minus y equal to 0, 0, 0. 8 minus 6 is 2, 0. 0. So, x minus y is equal to 2000. This is fourth equation. Next, solve equation 3 and 4 we get. Third equation is x plus y is equal to 22000. Fourth equation is x minus y is equal to 2000. Plus and minus cancel. 1x plus 1x is 2x is equal to 24000. So, x is equal to 24,000 divided by 2 is equal to 12,000. So, x value is 12,000. Next, substitute x is equal to 12,000 in equation 3. x plus y is equal to 22,000. x is 12,000 plus y is equal to 22,000. Y is equal to 22,000 minus 12,000 equal to 10,000. So, Y is equal to 10,000. Now, we will check this answer. He invested scheme A amount is rupees 12,000. Scheme B amount is rupees 10,000. 8 12 are 96 0 plus 900 to 100 900. You see, add this to 1860 comes. So, answer is correct. Next equation is this one. So, 9 into x is 12,000 divided by 100 plus 8 into y is 10,000 divided by 100. These two zeros cancel. These two zeros cancel. So, 9 12 are 108 0. Plus 8 into 100 is 800. So add this to 1880 comes. So the answer is correct. Thanks for watching this video.